Hello guys, what's up? I hope you all are doing well with the studies of diploma in elementary education. So today we are going to discuss question number one of assignment first of course 503 in English. You can watch the same video in Hindi on your channel Tastube. So the question which we are going to discuss today is explain the meaning of fine motor skills, how these skills can be developed in children. You have to write this answer in 500 words. So before writing the assignments, keep this in mind, the word limit is given. The word limit is 500 words. So keep this in mind. You can download this PDF as you can see on your screen. You can download this whole PDF from the description or you can go to our Facebook page, go on Facebook, search Tastube and you can download the PDF from there also. So you can download the PDFs from Facebook, Telegram and your YouTube. You can get the links of all these things in the description. So go into the description and get the links. Before starting this video, I would like to give you some updates related to Swayam. Some of the tests of course 501, 502 and 503 of your courses are going on your Swayam in week number 11. So go open your app and give the test if you have not given it. All the channels, all the answers of the tests are uploaded on your channel Tastube. So go and you can watch the test answers. You can comment us on Facebook, Telegram or you can mail us on asktastube at the red gmail.com if you have any problem related to diploma and elementary education. We will be pleased to solve your problem. Before starting the video, I would like to tell you that your first semester exams are going to start from 26, 27 and 28 February and you can get all the important question and answers on your channel for first semester till 15th of February as we are planning to make a schedule a syllabus for you all and all the sets of important questions for diploma and elementary education. So we will provide it to you till 15th of February. Keep this in mind. There will be 70 marks in your theory paper and the examination pattern will be like this. There will be 15 multiple choice questions, 15 very short answer type question, 10 short answer type question and 2 long answer type question. It is advisable to attempt the MCQs given on Swayam app. Also note the questions along with their answer for future references. Many of these questions might be asked in the examination as one mark and as MCQs. So keep this in mind, Swayam is very very important for you all. Go to your channel and subscribe your channel. For subscription, you have to click on this red button and after that, click on the bell icon for the latest updates and notifications. So go and subscribe your channel. Just now you all are seeing the official timetable for diploma and elementary education of two years. All the four semesters are mentioned in this. All the course syllabus, online registration, registration for examination, assignment submission, assignment update, result process, each and everything you can get in this timetable so go and watch this timetable and keep this in mind you can also go and give some of the tests which are going on your swayam app and you can also join your channel taste tube for the latest updates of tests so today we are going to discuss question number one explain the meaning of fine motor skills how these skills can be developed so the answer is fine motor skills involve the use of the smaller muscles of the hands commonly in activities like using pencils, scissors, construction with Lego or Duplo, doing up buttons and opening lunch boxes. <coughs> Fine motor skills efficiency significantly influences the quality of the task outcome as well as the speed of task performance. Efficient fine motor skills require a number of independent skills to work together to appropriately manipulate the object to perform the task. Fine motor skills let kids perform crucial tasks like reaching and grasping moving objects and using tools like crayons, pencils and scissors. As kids get better as using their hands, their hand-eye coordination improves. They also learn skills they need to succeed in a school such as drawing and writing. Developing these abilities helps kids become more independent and understand how their bodies work and as they learn how to have an impact on the world around them, their self-esteem may grow too. In order to encourage the development of these skills, children should be allowed to manipulate solid objects as they see fit. Holding, turning, twisting and playing with objects develops grasping ability in children. Another very important activity that provides children with enjoyment in addition to developing motor skills essential for writing is drawing. Therefore, children should be encouraged to draw. Children's early drawings often resemble meaningless scribbles which later evolve into discrenable shapes and figures. Apart from drawing, some other activities that help 
develop the motor skills necessary for writing includes games such as pouring water into a container, stringing beads and flowers, making objects out of clay, making objects out of clay or dove, etc. The home environment of the child provides him or her with enough opportunities to engage in such activities. However, this is not always the case. Therefore, it is necessary for teachers to help children engage in such activities wherever required. Practice letters, words, sentences. Generally, it is believed that achievement of sentence writing is helped by practicing writing letters and then words again and again. This is true to a certain extent. But if children are made to engage in tedious repetition of letters and words, they may be disenchanted with writing before they even begin to write. Therefore, while individual letters and word malas are useful in introducing children to writing, they might not be meaningful to children unless their relationship with whole words or sentences is made clear. Two things, respecting children's abilities and creating meaningful context in which they can learn are of great importance. In teaching children to write, it is necessary to appreciate the fact that the child has an immense innate capability to learn language. They learn their native languages naturally through meaningful social experiences involving speaking and listening. Similarly, they grasp the rules of writing mostly through meaningful expression involving written material. In teaching, we often act under the assumption that children need to be told everything and that they would not understand unless they are told. This is, however, it is not true. It is necessary to get rid of this mindset and to start respecting the capabilities of children. Children have a unique ability to write before coming to school. It is normal for children to create figures and symbols in sand on the floor or on, a, on paper and to make up stories about them. For them, these drawings are not meaningless, but rather they represent a unique script through which they express what they wish to say. Children should be given the opportunity to make full use of their abilities. Their process does not involve joining pieces of knowledge together to get the complete picture, but in fact it involves the opposite. The whole picture is formed first and then the specifics become clear in different ways. Unless a meaningful whole is supplied, the small specifics such as individual letters of the word malas or alphabets will not make sense and will be boring. So this was your answer to the question. You can download this PDF from the description. And uh, before writing the answers, I would like to tell you, don't copy the whole. You can use some of the lines. You can use your own creativity because this answer is not for you only. Many people are watching this answer and uh, this is common answer. So don't write common answers. You can change the front part. You can use some of your own lines because I have given you the points for writing the assignments. And keep in mind, you have to write the assignment in 500 words. So before writing, keep this in mind, write the assignment in 500 words and don't copy the whole answer because it will create trouble for you when the assignments will start getting checked. So don't write, don't copy the whole answer, use your own creativity, change some of the lines, upper body, middle body or lower body, you can change any lines. It is on you how you write, but write it beautiful, write in clean and clear handwriting and uh, you have to submit your assignments on your study center as the as NIUS has not announced your study centers but uh, they are planning and they are making reports of your study centers and they will announce soon when they will announce uh, you will be informed with the help of your channel so go and subscribe channel Tasty for the latest updates and uh, let me tell you you can watch all lectures of DL ed for first semester in English and Hindi in your channel Tasty so go and subscribe your channel Tasty and uh, I have uploaded all the answers of course 501 and course 502 on your channel Tube. For that you have to go to your YouTube and you have to type Tej Tube T E J T U B E Tej Tube and you have to click on the search button. After searching you have to click on your logo as you will you can see your logo Tej Tube. you have to click here and after clicking here you have to click on playlist as you can see you have to click on this playlist. After clicking on this playlist, you will get these two assignments. As you can see here, assignment for course 502 
and assign as you can see an ios dl solve assignment for course 502 in this playlist you will get all the answers related to assignment number course 502 in english and hindi both as you can see in english hindi english hindi and you can download the pdf from the description also so go in any of the video and you can download the pdf also same you can go to course number 501 playlist and you can download all the answers from this playlist so you can go and you can download all the videos of course and course 502 all the assignment videos on your channel so go subscribe your channel watch the videos like this video and go and share the videos watch the two videos which is upside and click on the circle to subscribe your channel so let us end this video jai hind long live india one day matram